Hello, end users. I want to demonstrate navigating the Files app on iOS, specifically on iPhone, where uh, this, with a Bluetooth keyboard specifically, uh, where this guide is not available. Um, so I went to my local Best Buy and uh, screenshotted uh, this guide, which isn't updated for iOS 15, notably. Um, and navigation is, I can't imagine any reason why you'd really need to do this on your phone, but, uh, and I'm still getting used to it because this, uh, the, the, uh, um, opposing keyboard shortcut, which is to go to the, to, to open a folder is not on this list, but command up and command down are how we get, uh, how we move between files and folders. So I'm going to go command up, that's the root uh, of that, and then command down is uh, is where we find this, and then if I go to command down, I could also use command O, as you see in there. Um, I wanted to make this super impressive. I've never used favorite up there, command control T, but this is definitely should be a favorite. Let's see, command control T. Is that doing anything? Uh, we have to go back all the way back here to, to tell, wouldn't we? Doesn't look like it. Can I only favorite directory directories? Oh, uh, well, here we go. I'm gonna use the ridiculously, um, let's see, where is it? I'm doing very well with this. I hope that you're, you think that I'm very professional. Um, let's just, so I'm, I'm using the control option command series of shortcuts to, to change the way that these are organized. I'm not doing very well. Uh, going to alt up and alt down is how we go to the very top or bottom, uh, of a list of folders. Um, here's where we were. I think, let's see, command control T. I think that that's maybe successfully did that. Yep, there we go. Now keys is favorited. Cool. Um, let's see. Another task that I needed to do is move this. So I'm going to do command C or command X. Let me try both. I need to move that. Whoops. Uh, I just did command shift I to go to iCloud Drive. I need to move that to assets. And let's see. I think it's command option V. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's move here. So that should be um, gone. Yep, it's gone. Um, let's see. What are some other ones we should try? Uh, oh yeah, we can, we can change the way they're viewed with the number keys. This is the command control option which is, if you think about it, if you try it on your keyboard, is a ridiculous shortcut to use. Um, let's see. Get info is a pretty useful one. I don't think I've ever used show in folder, but that makes sense. Quick look doesn't, doesn't work um, on iOS. Or yes, it does. Just not consistently. Okay, apparently it only works... Only works the first time that you land on a file, and now I can't make it go away. Brilliant, excellent. Let's try something else. Yep. Well, that worked. Um. Let's see. I'm sure that you're having. We can rename stuff uh, by just hitting uh, return, even though it's not working there. Um. Those are uh, directories that I cannot rename without fucking a bunch of shit up. Uh, let's see. This can be moved, actually. So I'm going to do... Wow. I keep doing the... Um, uh, it's, it's hard to get used to... Uh, the uh, to navigating with command up and down, even though I know that that's not actually that unusual of a of a thing. Yeah. So now I'm going to 
uh, Command Shift F is Browse Reasons, and then Command Shift B is Browse. Um, let's see. I think I did Alt, Alt plus Up or Down it takes you to the very beginning or very end. I don't. I don't know what what is Alt. Alt left right doesn't seem to do anything. Um. Wow, I really need to organize some of this stuff. <laughs> um, is there anything else I can show you? Uh, duplicate. Yeah, we could duplicate something. Um, oh yeah, there's creating a folder. Very cool. Uh, there's duplicating a file. Um, and like, so my my choice to do that is like with touch is to hold down uh if there is one person out there as i tweeted maybe there's one person out there who needs to do complex file manipulation on their phone specifically oh yeah i never did uh so we can do command two Command one is icons two is list three is nothing because we're on iphone um oh yeah we can do Command I to show the properties of the file. Uh, let's see. I think that that's sorry. I didn't, if I open that and then I do, I don't think Command R is going to work here. Um, and then of course, oh yeah, Command A, selecting all. Uh, more notably, and then I can escape out of that. Is if I hold Shift and then go down. I can select specific, I can make selections like that. And I think if I go, if I, nope, I was gonna try to use command to make another selection, but I can't. Um, let's see. Nope, not working now. I love it when things are inconsistent. There we go. Um, find is, you know, pretty useless still in the files app, unfortunately. Uh, creating a document that Actually, how does that? Yeah, that that just doesn't respond um, unless you're within one of the native apps that accesses the uh, files app. Um, and of course, again, all of this is subject subject to change. Uh, yeah, that's. I suppose that's the whole thing. Um, this section, we're going to specific uh, locations. What happens if I do c c Command Shift D? Oh yeah, the the connect to server is hilarious. Um, and uh, what was it? Command E to to eject. Uh, God damn it! I'm still hitting Enter because by reflex, I still have not gotten used to. Um, Control Shift D, Command Shift D. Downloads. Nope, that's desktop. Yeah, I do have a desktop somewhere. Documents. Yeah. All right. Well, that's navigating the files app with a Bluetooth keyboard on iPhone. I hope you're extremely wowed.